Hey guys, so Hello. today we are going to be doing um, olive oil hair relaxer. We're going to be doing a tutorial on how to do that because this guy right here has really curly hair, my client. <laughs> Just kidding, he's my boyfriend. Um, this is part two though. We did this, this before. Is the, yeah, this, we've done it before. He's really curly hair, but this is three months grow out of his hair. You turn your head to the side. It's pretty curly over here too. So this is the box I got off Amazon. It's olive oil hair relaxer. Yes. <laughs> okay. And here's what it comes with inside. This is the relaxer. So this is like the number one thing. You're going to stir it up. Mix for at least one minute or more. Failure to mix thoroughly can cause scalp irritation, hair damage, or hair mm -hmm. loss. You mix these. Yep. You mix these two together. You gotta make sure you mix it fully for like after. So they have like step B. Does this say step? Yeah, step A. Which is really nice. Instructions. Um, this is conditioner. So you want to wash it out with these two. Awesome. It's like when I dye my hair with blonde bleach and developer, it burns my fingers more than it burns this fingers. So I'm just going to... That's cool. Look at that. Pulling it off the page. So come to close. So um, we're going to leave it on for 13 to 15 minutes. <laughs> We've been needing to do this, but we haven't. This is three months girl, but he's been getting his hair cut. So these pieces are also at the very ends, curly. So, like, you see that? Like, I'm gonna have to do the ends, which it usually doesn't if you've already done it before, but his hair just grows like freaking weed. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you wanna get yourself a towel that is able to get dirty. It really doesn't even smell that bad, like my. And then we're gonna do this activator. Okay, pouring. B into A. Can you hand me the F? Be very careful when you mix it so it doesn't splash anywhere. Pour the entire contents of activator in. Check. Stir with for about, stir completely until both products are mixed. Expert. Um, for about one minute. Add the exotic oil boost. When did it, where did, when did it, make sure. after when it's, it's mixed? When it's completely mixed for at least a minute. So, one minute. Okay. Mix it good. Let me mix it. Just don't splash it. I know, I'm trying not to. You should put goggles on for this. Right. So Looks like cottage cheese. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Mix it good. Exotic oil boost. I want to eat it. it. Looks like ice cream. You do not. Does it hurt your fingers? No, I just don't want to get it on my fingers. Well, it's Add this in. Yep. Once it's fully mixed. And continue to stir for another minute. Good job. Oh, look at that. Good job. Okay, stir for another minute. We're making potions. <laughs> okay, that looks good. Okay, so we've got everything mixed and it says let's sit for five minutes. Oh, really? Yep, right here. Let product stand for five minutes before applying to hair. A small section of hair from the back of the head. That's my touchdown. Oh. oh, look at that. That's better. Ooh. Ooh. It doesn't smell bad at all, actually. Like, it doesn't even smell like chemicals at all. Last Ooh. time I didn't wear my gloves and nothing happened, so. And it was kind of more of a mess, TBH. Oh, uh, really? I also have one of these things, so I can apply it to the hair. But really try not to get the scalp because the scalp. Used to be treated with tender love and care. Ooh, it does. I'm a fragile. <laughs> I would recommend oh. having a wet paper towel to have just in case you get it on your skin. Yeah, that's or a wet paper towel. Anything on by your ear. 
remember last time I got your ear a little bit. But... Yeah. Okay, let's go. Okay, here we go. Putting it on. Can you turn on the side? Easy. I like the straight hair. It's fun. I like it a lot. I think I look better. And so does Malibu. I love you either way, babe. But I like it. It's fun. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. So you just kind of want to apply like that and then every now and then take a comb to it. Just really try not to get on the scalp. Yeah. moving quick good job i know it's these back edges that get curly really quick so i said it's really resistant i guess always gets curly. yeah you kind of want to move fast it's a hard job it is mel does such a good job thank you Oh. oh, also, do not do this what? on hair that has been bleached with developer and bleach because your hair will become stretchy and break off really, 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 really easy. Yeah, we did that the first time. He wanted me to put some highlights in his hair, and so I did, and then I was like, okay, let's straighten it next, and then it was like breaking off. But it wasn't that big of a deal because I only put like a little bit of highlights in. I didn't do the whole head. Like if I were to do the straightening on my hair, my hair would literally be gone. Be gone! I'm going to wait to do like the like hairline at the very end. So yeah. It's already getting like straight. You can kind of like feel it. You have a lot of stuff. Like, I'm going to tell you right now, if you're doing a boy's hair with, like, the not enough hair, like, it doesn't go down to his freaking neck, you have a lot of stuff that you can layer it on and, like, don't be shy. Last time you got your neck a little bad, remember? Yeah. Keep getting my ears a lot. Different. So now I'm taking this section and I'm gonna go like this. I'm gonna grab the hair like this. Can you turn to that side, babe? I'm gonna grab the hair like this. Try not to get on the root. And then also go up here. And then flip it over and then do that side. But go it. Make sure you're um, using your hair, your fingers and your comb to brush the hair in the direction you want it to go. It's like what way you part your hair. Mm-hmm. Well, but that's such a good job. It's hard. It takes a long time too. Hi. Go on back here. Yeah, your back of your head's like super. Super curly. Curly hair is out. No one has curly hair anymore. <laughs> mm -hmm. But I'm stuck with it. So that's why I've got to do this. Yeah. You say you're about halfway done? Yeah, I am. Awesome. You did you didn't down here too, right? Mm hmm. So I couldn't remember if we did that last time or not. <laughs> Or what? It's not crunchy, babe. Oh, it just sounded crunchy. <laughs> crunchy. Thank you very much. I don't know if I said that too. Just like, thank you very much. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. Mm. You're right here, just get a little more hair, you're done. Yeah, but what about all this stuff? I don't know. I know, but you don't want to get too much on there. Feels like you put a lot. Like you got a good coat. Always in there somewhere. 
also says on the timing chart, you can go up to 20 minutes. That's for like... For mm -hmm. extra strength hair textures. For coarse and resistant. We're finally done. We've done the whole coat on the whole head and brushed it through. Mm -hmm. You want to make sure you brush it through because then it gets to all the, all the hairs. This is what I look like with a buzz cut. You look cute. <laughs> and hey. then we just set the timer for how long? For 12 minutes. We're going to leave it in and sit like this. And then we're going to wash it out. Mm -hmm. Okay, so. <laughs> so I'm so tall. We have five more minutes left on the clock mm -hmm. to wash it out. It's a bamba! The shampoo that they give us, and then also the conditioner. And then I'm also gonna use my own shampoo and conditioner because last time I did it, I didn't like get it out fully with all the shampoo and conditioner. And then I'm also gonna do a hair mask and then like all the oils, all the leave-in conditioner and detangler. Like your hair is gonna be very brittle after you do this. So you're gonna need all the good stuff. <laughs> One water, five minutes. Alexa, oh. set timer for five minutes. No, you gotta just wash it out till it's washed out. I know. Oh, it's a little hot. Okay, I'm gonna wash it out. Oh, it's gonna get the neck really good and the scalp. If it's pink, then that means that there's still some product in there. Here. Um. So after five minutes of just water, now it's time to add in the creamy aloe shampoo. Look how straight that is, guys. That's true. It's a very long process. Here's this one. I want to use the whole thing of this because they're really giving it to you. Here, I'm going to um, have you soap. Oh. We like to use, we like bought some of the actual conditioner of this. And he uses it every now and then when he showers. So you can do that too to keep your hair like. But I'm sure there's better options because, you know, there's, just, there's a lot of options for conditioning that will help your hair. Alexa, set timer for 10 minutes. Is that all yeah. 10 minutes, 39. Oh. Oh, you can put a shower cap on, which the instructions. Wait, coming out with me? I'm looking at you. Oh, you look so handsome. Okay. So we're gonna wash that out and then I'm gonna show you the finished product. Oh, I look good. Oh. Okay, I think you're done. And then we can put some leave-in conditioner in and some oil. Okay, really good, guys. It looks like natural too. That does look good and it feels way better. It's like mm -hmm. styled, but he's gonna grow his hair out longer so it's gonna be longer, but this is it styled. Much better than before. Yeah, the back is all all straight. He looks, looks so good. handsome. Mm -hmm. He looks so cute. It's a success. Yeah, definitely recommend. Yeah, but next time we do it, we're gonna like have his hair grown out more, so it's gonna look great. Mm -hmm. Cutie pie. Oh. Gotta go to work. Let us know if um we helped you in any way with your <laughs> process yeah hair straightening process yeah thank you guys bye bye